Good morning. Welcome to or good day, whichever time you're watching. This is another five minute life hack. Um, have you ever entered a contest and have you ever felt like you were going to win or have you ever won some kind of a contest? Uh, when I was probably in first grade, second grade, we had a big jelly bean jar at our in our classroom and we had to guess how many jelly beans were in the jar. And I was, I think I was 83 and I guessed 82. I was right on. Um, and so I, I won the contest and I was so excited as a little kid. I thought it was great, but um, ironically, I felt like I uh, was, I was really good at contests ever since, even though that's probably the only one I've ever won. <laughs> so it was kind of uh, interesting that way, but um I think today we're going to talk a little bit about a contest in life. And if I can find the right tab, there we go. I'm going to talk about a different kind of contest. So here we go. There we go. All right. So the magic bank account. Some of you may have heard this. Uh, some of you may have not. But first time I heard it, I thought it was fantastic. So um Imagine that you have won the following prize in a contest. Each morning, your bank account deposits $86,400 into your private account for personal use. However, this prize has very specific rules. Everything you didn't spend during each day would be taken away from you. You may not simply transfer money into some other account. You may only spend it. This has some very strict rules. <laughs> Each morning, the bank account, uh, the bank account deposits. Uh, sorry, the bank deposits into your account eighty six thousand four hundred dollars for that day. The bank can end the game without warning at any time. It can say game over. It can close the account, and you will not receive a new one. Yes. What would you personally do? Maybe you would buy anything and everything you wanted not only for yourself, but for all the people you love and care for, maybe even for people you don't know, because you couldn't possibly spend it all on yourself. No doubt you would try to spend every penny and use it all because you know it will be replenished the next morning, right? Actually, the game is real. Each of us is already a winner of this prize. You just don't realize it or think about it. The prize is time. Each morning, each of us wakes up and receives 86,400 seconds as a gift of life. When we go to sleep at night, the remaining time is not credited to us. What we haven't used up for that day is forever lost. Yesterday is forever gone. Each morning the account is refilled, but your account can be dissolved at any time and without warning. So what will you do with the daily gift of 86,400 seconds? Those seconds are worth so much more than that same amount in dollars. Think about it. <clears throat> and remember to enjoy every second of your life because time races by so much more quickly than you think it will. Take care of yourself. Love the Lord with all your heart. Be happy. Love deeply. Enjoy every second of your life you have been given. And start spending i like that story a lot <clears throat> the question for us is what are we doing with our life and there's been a lot of talk recently about being intentional i heard at one time talking about it as being intensely intentional and that just kind of fits my personality a little bit more um so really focusing on things that matter so uh, i've had you know, multiple experiences recently of loved ones, people I know, or, or acquaintances um, who have passed away or received, you know, terminal cancer diagnoses, things like that. And it always just hits me like a ton of bricks. Like really, we don't control our time here. Um, my wife is an avid hiker and yesterday she went hiking and stepped right next to a rattlesnake and literally within like a foot or two and the rattle came out and she got scared and, you know, it, you know, obviously didn't bite her or anything, but 
you know, sometimes things can happen. Um, you know, even something like this. Yesterday, I was playing volleyball with some friends, which I love to do, and that's one of the things I I try to enjoy is sports. Um, but I injured my wrist, and so probably for the next month, I don't know if it's fractured. I probably have to go get an X-ray. But for the next month, I probably can't do a lot of the things I enjoy doing with that hand. So I have to pivot and do other things. Um, anyway, life, life is definitely short. Uh, there's a great song by Tim McGraw. Many of you know it, Live Like You Are Dying. Um, in a lot of ways, I think that's a that's a good way to live. We, we have this amazing balance we have to find in life of living for today and enjoying today, but also preparing and planning uh, for the future. And it's a, it's a beautiful, complicated, difficult balance. But I hope you can be intensely intentional with your life. Appreciate it. Enjoy. Have a fantastic day and go make an impact.